My name is Tembi, so my name is Biela. Um, my lesson, I'm teaching mathematics and I'm doing 3D uh, objects. The second step is the introduction of the 2D shapes and the 3D shapes uh, to give me more and the prior uh, knowledge that they have about 2Ds and the 3D shapes. What is 3D? Payanda. The land and the bread and the heart. Yes, the land, bread, and what? Uh -huh. And us. That is a dimension number one, dimension number two, and the dimension number three. Okay? Yes. Now, let's talk about the, uh, the 2D. Tomega. A length and a breadth. And dimension number one, it's a length, and dimension number two is what? It's breath. a breadth. All right? Okay. Can you give me an example of the 2D shape? An example of the 2D shape. What are they? It's a square. It's a square. <laughs> and what is important to be known about the square? What can you say? Once this thing is not there, it's not a square. What can I say about it? Alicia? All sides are equal. All sides must be equal. Yeah. Then if you're converting that 2D into a 3D, we are having the square in the 2D. Now what it is actually in the, three, in the 3D shape? Obani. It's a cube. It's a cube. That's correct. Please get hands for Obani. Right, let us make the cube then. Right. Now I'm comparing this cube with partner. With this shape. Then you are going to tell me what is this shape. Then I have two shapes here. You told me that one is it's a cube. What about this one? It's a rectangular prism. It's a rectangular prism. It's a rectangular prism. Q, rectangular prism. We are comparing the two. Let us compare the faces. How can you say about the faces of the Q? How many faces does the Q have? No wonder. There are six faces. There are six faces. The Q has six faces. Yes. Let us count the faces here. One, two, three, four, five, six. six. Okay. Yes. Yes. Then rectangular prism. How many faces are there? Dalo? There are six faces in the rectangular prism. So what does this tell us? It tells us that the faces of the cube and the faces of the rectangular prism are the same, okay? Yes. Let me ask the edges. The edges. If you are talking about the edges, we are talking about these lines here. These lines. Here, I am talking about these lines. These are the edges. How many edges in the cube? Some of There are 12 edges. 12 edges in the cube. Then, one, one two, three, three four. four. We are done here in the middle, right? Let us go to the bottom. We say four here, yeah? yes. Then proceed. Five, six, seven, eight. On top now. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So, therefore, we are having how many edges in the cube? Twelve. So right. right. Then, the rectangular prism. Hindi, left. There are 12 edges. 12 edges. Let us count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we are correct for the same chart. Then how many matrices do we have in a cube? We are talking about the matrices. Samantha. They are eggs.
Eight vertices in a cube, right? Yes. 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 So that character are eight. Then in a rectangular prism, that they are? They are eight vertices. Yes, eight vertices in a rectangular prism. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Okay, yeah? Yes. Right. The method that I use was uh, uh, questions and answers whereby I'm involving the learners to be part of the lesson. That's the other one. Not to be autocratic, but you have to be learner-centered. Let us make the net from this cube. <coughs> right. This is a net of what? Of a cube. Okay? Now, if we are assembling this net, it's supposed to give us a cube, okay? Yes. We say how many edges are here? Twelve. I say twelve, right? Yes. Then how many faces are here? Six. Six. That is why we are having this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay? Yes. Now, if I'm assembling this thing, this cube, into a net, cutting my cube down. To make a net of a cube. This is a net of a cube. Now you see. So this is a net, okay? Yes. Right. You are going to take this shape, this 3D shape, next to the net that it suits this shape. Uh, Amanda. Is Amanda correct? Yes. 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 This is a cube and this is a net of a, of a cube. Because it's the name of a, a certain 3D object. Nandi, huh? Yes, Nandi is correct. This is what? This is a cube. And this is a net of a cube. Two D rectangle. Yes. Yes. Bayana is correct. The rectangle. Like, like this. This is what class? This is what? A rectangle. Thereafter, we do the practical works using the sticks, such as um, the, the, the toothpicks with the soft sticks so that they can make and construct the object that uh, we were doing in a lesson. Yeah. Oh, two picks. Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, clap hands for the, the group E. <laughs> Well done, group A. This is? Pentagonal it's a pentagonal shape or pentagonal prism. Then here? Rectangular. Rectangular prism. Then on this group, you were doing? Rectangular prism. Rectangular prism, right? I think now we are done with the practicals. I'm going to give you maybe the papers uh, to complete it at home as your homework, right? Yeah. Then you are done with this lesson of the 2D shapes and the 3D shapes, okay? I'm enjoying just to be part and to play the role of uh, making South African youngsters to become more in the future.